I wish it was as predictable for all of us as it is for the patients, but it is actually not predictable. Labor actually involves three stages. There is a stage one, which is what women normally call labor, which is till the time she delivers the baby. The stage two of labor is the actual process of childbirth, and the stage three of labor is what is taken as after childbirth. So the first stage of labor can actually have a latent phase and an active phase. The latent phase is till the cervix reaches a dilatation of 3 to 4 centimeters, after which is the active phase. The latent phase may have variable uh, length. However, once a patient is in active stage of labor, we assume that if it's a first baby, the cervix should be dilating at a speed of about 1 centimeter per hour and if it is a second or a third day baby, around 0.5, uh, around 2 centimeters in an hour. However, if the, there is no dilatation for 2 hours or if the baby does not descend by about a centimeter in an hour, we would call it failure to descend or progress of labor.